The father of the Kirkersville police chief who was shot and killed back in 2017 is being told by his HOA to remove a flag that he says honors the life and legacy of his fallen son. Tonight, NTV's Bryant Somerville investigates the situation and hears from the company who says it's only enforcing the rules. How do you measure a day? How do you even still process that day? It's very hard. How do you measure 1,833 days? Tom Desario measures every day as one more day without him, one more day removed from that day. May 12, 2017, he had just left Bible study when it came across his radio. You knew. Mm -hmm. I knew. I knew when I heard shots fired on the, on the radio. He knew his son, Kirkersville Police Chief Stephen Eric Desario, was gone. He rushed to the hospital where eventually he said goodbye. The point I seen him and seen what that murderer did to him, I just broke down. Every day since has been measured by memories and measured by a three by five police flag that has flown on the flagpole in his front yard. To me, that represents my son. For five years and one week now, that flag has caught the Midwestern breeze flowing through Etna Township. Then, just this week... They have told me in this letter that it's propaganda. Desario received a letter from Omni Community Association managers on behalf of his neighborhood's HOA, telling him to remove the flag, calling it a political statement. Desario says he backs police because of his son, but says this flag... Do you view that flag as political? No, under no way, shape, or form. The furthest thing from politics. The life of my son. You know, something that I can get up in the morning and look at and remember my son. Talking with an Omni spokesperson Thursday, it was agreed upon by Desario when he signed his deed, not to display signs that are political in nature. The spokesperson also saying it is only an enforcer acting as the result of a recent complaint and called 10TV pursuing this story sensationalism, saying it could have all been avoided if Desario would have honored his agreement. I would love to see police flags all over the place because I don't think they can win. Desario says he'll get three notices. After that, he could be fined. If he's still not in compliance, the matter could go to court. I've already told the HOA, you try to come in my yard and take it down, you better bring the sheriff with you because you're not taking it down. Even one day without his child, he says, immeasurable. 1,833 days, unimaginable. But the flag, he says, makes it a little more bearable. And that's why it will continue to fly. In Etna, Bryant Somerville, 10 TV News. Now, the former nursing home where Tom's son and two others are killed has been closed since 2018.